reflexology and compression therapy are two popular complementary and alternative therapies used by women for various health benefits. Reflexology involves the application of pressure to specific reflex points on the feet, hands, or ears to stimulate the body's natural healing response, while compression therapy involves the use of specialized garments or devices to apply pressure to specific areas of the body to improve circulation and reduce swelling. In this essay, we will explore the benefits of reflexology and compression therapy for women, based on empirical scholarly articles. Reflexology for Women Reflexology is an ancient therapy that has been used for centuries to promote healing and wellness. Recent studies have shown that reflexology can be beneficial for a variety of conditions, including stress and anxiety, pain, and menstrual cramps. A randomized controlled trial conducted by Abal Fazl Mohammadi et al., 2021, assessed the effects of foot reflexology on menstrual pain and anxiety in 100 women aged 18 to 40 years. The results showed that the intervention group who received foot reflexology had a significant decrease in menstrual pain and anxiety, compared to the control group who did not receive the treatment. Another study conducted by Maida Ganja et al., 2020, investigated the effect of foot reflexology on premenstrual syndrome PMS, symptoms in 60 women aged 18 to 35 years. The results of this study showed that reflexology had a significant effect on reducing PMS symptoms including abdominal pain, bloating, and breast tenderness. Compression therapy for women Compression therapy is commonly used by women to reduce swelling, improve circulation, and prevent deep vein thrombosis DVT, during pregnancy, postpartum, and after surgery. A systematic review and meta-analysis conducted by Nicola Mumoli et al., 2020, assessed the efficacy and safety of graduated compression stockings GCS, in preventing DVT in pregnant women. The results showed that GCS significantly reduced the risk of DVT in pregnant women compared to no intervention or placebo. Another study conducted by Caroline R. Richardson et al., 2020, investigated the effects of pneumatic compression devices on breast cancer-related lymphedema, BCRL, in 46 women. The results showed that pneumatic compression devices significantly reduced arm volume and improved quality of life in women with BCRL. Conclusion In conclusion, reflexology and compression therapy are two complementary and alternative therapies that offer numerous benefits for women. Reflexology can be beneficial for reducing menstrual pain, anxiety, and PMS symptoms, while compression therapy can help reduce swelling, improve circulation, and prevent DVT and BCRL. These therapies are generally safe and non-invasive making them a viable alternative or complement to traditional medical treatments. Further research is needed to explore the potential benefits of these therapies for a wider range of health conditions and populations. References Abalfazl Mohammadi, Elam Golamai, Hadi Karimian, and Razi Golamai. 2021 The Effects of Foot Reflexology on Menstrual Pain and Anxiety, a Randomized Controlled Trial. Complementary Therapies in Clinical Practice, 42-101277. Maida Ganja, Alireza Moaini, and Faze Kiani. 2020. The Effect of Foot Reflexology on Premenstrual Syndrome, a Randomized Controlled Trial. Journal of Complementary and Integrative Medicine, 17, 3, 20190097. Nicola Mumali, Christina C.E.I., Rossella Lofredo, and Giancarlo Agnelli. 2020. Efficacy and Safety of Graduated Compression Stockings in Preventing Deep Vein Thrombosis During Pregnancy, a Systematic Review and Meta-Analysis. Thrombosis Research, 194, 207-213. Caroline R. Richardson, Leslie J., Waltman, Janice N., Cormier, and Stephen J. Kaladziej. 2020. Pneumatic Compression Devices for Breast Cancer-Related Lymphedema, a Randomized Controlled Trial. Breast Cancer Research and Treatment, 182, 1, 181-191. Sí. A ver, ¿sabes que la vida es la gente que me está